Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Well, this is the Jumper T Pro. It is a radio for the RC hobby that came out earlier this year. It's pretty cool. It's inexpensive and it is very useful. It comes in a 4-in-1 model and an ELRS model. The reason for my video today is because there is a new accessory for this Jumper T Pro. Now, if we take a look at the top switches, over here you have a momentary switch, then a three-way switch, another three-way switch and a momentary switch and two potentiometers. Those momentary switches were a little bit of a heartache for some people because if you are in hobbies such as I'm in, like FPV drone hobby, there goes my pointer, put that over there, then uh, these switches, well, you press them in and they don't stay in, they're just a momentary switch. So a lot of us have programmed our radios so that when we press in both of them, it arms the drone or disarms the drone. Or you can use the three-way switch, which many of us have done as well. So a lot of people complain that there was no latch switch on here. Well, Jumper T-Pro must have listened to people because now they have that. And here it is right here. It's called the T-Pro self-locking switch. And if you want to order it, there is the item number. I don't know when it's going to be available on the site. It might be available now that you're watching this. But I'm not really sure. This just showed up at my house. So what it is, is a do-it-yourself kit. Basically, you have the frame, the bottom half of the Jumper T Pro frame, and you have a latch switch here. Press it in, it goes out. Press it in, it stays in. So that's it. And that switch is built in right here. So you can see there's nothing else on the bottom. So that means in order to install this switch, you have to keep it on the base plate and you have to take the base plate off of this unit. And then you have to take everything that is screwed into this base plate. You, when you open it up, you'll see what I mean. And you have to screw all of those components into this base plate. And then you have to put this plate on here. It sounds more complicated. It's actually quite easy. I took it apart earlier. I was going to put it on, but then I thought, you know what? I've gotten used to this three-way switch and these momentary switches, so I'm okay with it. But if you want the latch switch, well, then you can easily do it yourself. All right, so that's it. That's all this video was about, just to show you a new product for the Jumper T Pro. And I will put links below to the Jumper site, just in case it becomes available sooner than later. Check it out. All right, guys, catch you in the next video. Bye.